With the approval of another COVID-19 vaccine, new shipments have been arriving in Central Florida. Leaders in Seminole County say they unpacked their boxes today and are ready to start administering the vaccine tomorrow. News 6 Tori Campbell is live in the newsroom tonight, digging deeper into what we expect to see during the next couple of days here at home and who the governor plans to prioritize next. Troy. Well, Ginger, according to Governor Ron DeSantis, Florida is expected to receive almost twice as many Moderna vaccines this week than the amount received of the Pfizer vaccine last week, meaning there will be a lot more to be administered. Seminole County saying their front, their frontline workers will receive their first doses tomorrow. This video given to News 6 by Seminole County, showing boxes of the Moderna COVID-19 vaccine arriving on Tuesday. County leaders saying starting Wednesday, their initial 8,100 doses will begin to be administered to healthcare workers as well as EMTs and paramedics. Moderna saying their vaccine only requires regular freezer storage with two doses taken 28 days apart. While in the villages, Governor Ron DeSantis saying Florida could receive up to 750,000 more doses of both the Moderna and Pfizer vaccines in the next week and a half. DeSantis adding after healthcare workers and long-term care facility residents are vaccinated, the state will prioritize its 4.4 million people over the age of 65. Our vaccines are going to be targeted for our elderly population. We are not going to put young, healthy workers ahead of our elderly, vulnerable population. In Orange County, Mayor Jerry Demings releasing this photo, saying the first of about 16,000 doses of the Moderna vaccine have arrived. Mayor Demings adding the Florida Department of Health in Orange County is standing by, ready to help vaccinate EMS workers. Governor DeSantis saying the nearly 370,000 doses will go to 173 hospitals across the state. It's going to be reserved for you, um, but not everyone's going to be able to do it on day one. It's going to take some time to be able to make sure everybody has, has access. Governor DeSantis went on to say he projects Florida could receive as many as 2 million doses of any approved COVID-19 vaccine by the end of next month. Seminole County also says if CVS or Walgreens need assistance administering vaccines inside long-term care facilities, they too are ready to step in. Live in the newsroom tonight, Troy Campbell getting results, News 6. Troy, thank you. Tomorrow